Hello lovelies, welcome back to my channel, Serena V here. Today I'll be making five cards using the Sokotoa stamp set from Altenew and their Shades of Purple ink set. And then I'll be using their Fenstone decorative element as well as some Tombow products like the Tombow Black Dual Brush Pen, the Tombow 3D Foam Tabs, and this new Tombow Mono Adhesive Plus Permanent Glue, which I'm loving and I can't wait to show you guys how it works. So let's get started with the first card. So I'll be using this new Tombow Mono Adhesive Plus Permanent and here I'm just showing you that the applicator actually moves back and forth. It has a unique instant start system that advances the adhesive on the roll to the tip after every use, which ensures an instant start exactly where you place down every time. So you guys can see in this video that it's so quick, it runs smoothly, and I was just showing you there a little bit how it works, and I'll show you again later in another card. This is the Fenstone Decorative Element from Altenew, and I just cut it in half and I off-centered it so that I can add a sentiment from the Sokotoa stamp set in the center. And you know me, I can't leave anything simple, so I had to add some bling onto it just to further decorate the card. And I really love how it looks, it's very simple but yet very elegant at the same time. For the second card, I'm going to make a triangle pattern. Here I'm just using the Shades of Purple ink set and I'm loving these colors. These are a dye based ink and when they dry they're so luscious. These colors are very very vibrant and beautiful. And so I'm using the different triangles in the set. Some of the solid and some of the open triangles like here. I'm just using the black dual brush pen to add those black elements that I want onto uh, my card. So I'm using the striped and then the solid and then the outline uh, triangles as well. And this is, I think, my favorite color. It's just so beautiful and vibrant. I'm just going with the flow and creating random patterns. And there's so many things you can do with this stamp set. There are so many different styles of triangles and you can make so many different patterns. I'm just using the Black Marble Dilutions ink just to add some black splatters around the card and it's done! This is my favorite card, I have to say it, it's, it turned out really cool. So I was playing around with the inks and I started to just press down the paper with the um, ink block and it would create a fun like circular impression. So I did this with all four colors of the Shades of Purple set. And I just love the look that it created. When I went over the darker inks with the light purple, it just created such an amazing impression, which I'll show you in a close little look at it after. And of course, adding some more blade. I wanted to enhance the round sides of the circular impression, so that's why I added all these rhinestones in a random order. Now I'm using the Tombow 3D foam tabs to add dimension to this card, so I really wanted it to stand out. And I'm using the Tombow Mono Aqua Liquid Glue to glue down my sequins. These are like an iridescent white, but it picks up the purple on the card really nicely and adds an extra touch. I just really love how this card turned out, it's one of my favorites. And here I'm just showing you what I was talking about earlier, the impression that the lighter ink looked on top of the darker purple. It just turned out really cool and in person this card is really awesome. So next I'm doing another triangle pattern set and what I did here was I did this off camera because it's kind of like the same thing I did in the first triangle pattern. I just stamped the triangles in a different pattern. I used the same U Rock sentiment because I really love it. And again, using the Tombow 3D foam tabs to add a raised effect to this card. And now I'm using some crystal stickles to further decorate the card. I really want it to sparkle and I just really wanted the purple to pop. And of course, adding some more sequins and bling, I just couldn't resist. And finally, the last card, we'll be making a triangle background. So these triangle shapes are perfect to make your own Project Life cards, your own 
basic background patterns and that's what I did here. I just took the solid triangle and the striped triangle in the smaller version and I just used the four different colors that come in the shades of purple ink set again and I just stamped everything randomly and I'm using the smaller triangle sets to fill in the gaps. And here I just took the solid small triangle stamp and use my black dual brush pen again to add some black touches on the card and I really love how that looked. So again I'm using the Tombow Mono Adhesive Plus glue to glue down these papers and it has easily become my favorite adhesive runner ever because I'm telling you the application it runs so smoothly and every time you press it down it has an instant adhesive. You don't have to fidget with the applicator as soon as you press it down to your paper you have instant adhesive where you pressed so it's really really amazing and I urge you guys to try it out if you can because it has become my favorite adhesive runner. So now I'm just adding a sentiment from the stamp set and this Sakatoa stamp set is really great. It has so many different sentiments for every occasion and I really love it. And of course finishing off the cart with some bling because I couldn't resist. So I hope you guys enjoyed my five tutorials on how to make five different cards using the Sakatoa stamp set. I really love Alton News products. You guys should check them out. And if you want to participate in the blog hop that's going on right now, I'll have the link down below. You have an amazing chance of winning some great prizes from Alton New, like a $30 gift card. We are also giving away Tombow Erotogen colored pencils in the Vivid Pack and also an adhesive bundle. There's also a coupon code, so there's a lot of amazing things going on. Check out my blog post and follow along with everybody else on this hop from Alton U and Tombow USA for more inspiration and a chance to win these amazing prizes. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more tutorials and have yourself a wonderful day. Bye everyone!